Dude, that Asian food I bought actually kind of sucked. <laughs> Where'd you get it? Giant Palace. Is that the one right there? The one right there on the public stand. Yeah. Is it good? No. Yeah. No. No, see, I felt bad because I didn't want to just, like, show up unexpectedly because you weren't counting on me being here and then, like, take your food. I, I always feel bad uh, because, you know, it costs money. God, I already spent $200 on food. Hmm? You spent $200 on food? Okay. Like, these last three days? Like, these la this Thursday and last two Thursdays? I'm not sure if it's that long, but just that the credit report came in. My mom looked at it and told me I spent $200 on food. That was including you, right? Like, uh -huh. just what you eat well, daily? Because that makes more sense. Well, that, I don't know. well, I mean, stop and take a look at hibachi. The, the, the sushi plates, if you go there once a week, like me. Yeah. I, I've been set on for just getting two orders of that fried uh, tempura shrimp. Sure. Wait, you hit record and you didn't say that welcome back to Captober? Yep. What is wrong with you? It's Captober, by the way, folks. Strange gloomy wall. Did it say doomy? Gloomy. gloomy. Oh, about to say. Uh, cause the wall <laughs> says it's doomy! It, I thought it said doomy. I thought I saw a D. It's uh, funny because we have some uncomfortable. No, no, no. Right here. We found them. Oh, look. It's the regular mannequins. One of those new creatures that were in the previous area. They're so Italian. What do they do? Whoop. Symbiotic relationship. Now they're even more annoying to fight because they always have an active hitbox around them with those blades. And the flowers? What will I ever do? Okay, that was the answer. <laughs> wow, man, you were just making yourself look stupid. You look, you had so much confidence, and then it just whisked away. I think I would like this game more if I saw numbers above their head. Even if it was completely arbitrarily decided numbers that were different every time you hit. I mean, that's what made Monster Hunter World so good, you know? Numbers. Yeah, numbers. Oh, I just need to get a, I think a B or a K. I wonder if people figure it out, um... <coughs> um Ow. I apologize. Oh, bless you. I wonder if people figure it out, uh, what the hit points of each monster at, and what any average rank is yet. Huh. That must have been a bit They, they even have uh, um, multipliers for the, the damage dealt by them. Wow. On uh, uh, oh. tempered and arc tempered. I mean, before they just had uh, estimating. Uh, you know, no, there was already counted, but it was tedious. Yeah, well, yeah. Do you know how much work I put on the Fextra Life fixing up their gear pages and stuff? You went on Fextra Life and fixed their gear pages? Yes. Dude, they had Odag they had uh, uh, half of the Odagger on gear spelled wrong. It, it, when, when World first came out, do you know how much shit I actually went in there and fixed? What is Odogoron? Okay, so I had to fix Clifford the Big Red Dog's uh, gear pages. Well, take that out of context and just remove the phrase when he says, I had to fix Clifford the Big Red Dog. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, God. Mm -hmm. Oh, look, a stairway. Dude. You're trying to imagine fixing. Oh, my God. Yeah, um, I don't think so. No. No one you're going to stop playing for me. 
No one here likes how the camera turns. It's not really platforming. You're you're just walking. Stop! 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 Fall off and die. <laughs> you don't dash when you're in a platform. Oh, it doesn't kill you. It makes you backtrack. That's even worse. I love it. I'm going all Like, we got Goblin Slayer. The Goblin Slayer looks so good. We got, like, uh, a slice of life that I can actually enjoy with the skeleton that works at a comic book shop. Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> There's a slice of life for a skeleton that works at a uh, library. This is a comic book shop. Is it a comic book shop or a library? It's a library that specializes in comic books. That's stupid. But okay. It's in Japan, so do you mean manga? Yes. Oh, you almost died. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't change. I'm gonna change it to a weapon that doesn't make me accidentally dash for or you just press, or you just stop pressing forward and attack. No, you know what, Jam? I'm really liking about this season is the uh, uh, reincarnated as a slime. I started watching that. And I thought it I'm actually really impressed with this. The only thing I don't like is how I watch the album slam before it, so I'm just like. Yeah. <laughs> and then you see the goblins, and you're like, the only good cop is a dead goblin. What's going on here? <laughs> oh. <laughs> it was. Funny. Oh shit! Now I have to watch it. What, Goblin Slayer or... Both. Watch Goblin Slayer first and then... Okay. <laughs> Reincarnated as a slime. It's really funny. There's just such a complete contrast. You know, funny enough, after watching the first episode of Goblin Slayer, I really don't see the manga. That's funny. The manga is only 25 chapters long, so I... If there's a season 2, I'm worried. I don't no, um, Reincarnated as a Slime is uh, supposedly getting 24 episodes this season. Yeah, dude, I'm so happy about that. For me. I wish that killed. If the manga is done and they decide to keep going with the show, it doesn't really matter because they're not, it's not like they're going away from source material. If there is no more source material. Okay, it died. Now you just have to wait. And not dash. What's his luck? I mean, this isn't platforming. Can't. This is waiting. You, sh you should do it. You should go for it. No! I think it's... <laughs> Come on. I the mean, only way it makes it tempting to go for it is that they do this arbitrary thing where the platforms go around! Well, they expected you to take a lot longer. Wait, look up, look up. You can totally go for it, man. No. Do it. I know you got this. Come on, it's Captain Uber. You're good at platforming in this game. Yeah, Not it's clearly one. a platformer. I mean, it's what you're meant to do. Uh, <laughs> oh, dang it. <laughs> okay, now go back and do it the right way. so happy. <laughs> go back and do it the right way. <laughs> IGN is Crate, not Kratos. I was referencing By the way, a video. Your streams guitar hero. Yes! Twitch forward slash Crate. Underscore 13. Underscore XIII. Do you think people, if I had a stream where I just played a bunch of obscure old video games that I no one knows about? I think that's what the YouTube about? where I 
play uh, or, or have posted some of my FCs. And yes, especially if you make them sort of the speedrunner community because they love that. What? I mean, I don't think there's a speedrunning community for Dragon Player on NES. There's but... a speedrunning community for everything. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, have you seen the mod of the, the 10 YouTubers versus a uh, Mario 64 speedrunner? I've seen all the two speedrunners versus all those people. Sorry, the lobby version. I don't get it. It's so fun. I don't get it because I mean, it's not like it's not like all their their times are being like. It's not like they help each other out. It's just 11 people all against each other. Not really 10 against one. No, they're trying to reduce the one person. So. The way I saw it is it's two speedrunners, one of them is just a regular player, one of them's like a world championship, like, world, like, fast mm -hmm. speedrunner. And so the, there'll be ten toads trying to interrupt him and mess up his time, and then the person that is not the championship winner is trying to beat him with that handicap. Well, I don't think that's how it works differently, where they set up a fixed emulation of Mario 64, where there can be ten Marios on one emulation, and then two Marios on the other one. And then they try to see who can get the most stars within a certain amount of time. Oh, see that? See that one makes sense to me. So, are they all able to go like their own way? Like, mm -hmm. okay. See that? That makes it interesting. That makes it fun. That's crazy. Like, I think the minimum of thirty star challenge the like regular got it, but like whenever there's higher numbers involved. The regulars can't beat the speedrunners just because they can't get past the uh, what is that King Rainbow Bomb. Road? Oh, Rainbow is that what's called the Rainbow Bridge, the one with the uh... oh Rainbow Cruise. Yeah, Rainbow Cruise. But Rainbow Cruise is so easy. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, it's such a fun map. I like Rainbow Cruise. Yeah, I mean, it's time to go beyond the limit. You know, the shitty one's the one that's like opposite to it, where you have to get the red coins, and if you fall, you have to go all the way in front of the castle. By the way, kids, you just saw the entire plot of Beyblade. With Moses. I'm sorry. <laughs> I forgot the part where he parted the Red Sea with the Beyblade. That's... That happens too. What? In the Beyblade anime, Moses appears and he parts the Red Sea with a Beyblade. God, the burning bush gave him a Beyblade. Yes. <laughs> take this the and God max Beyblade. Out your, take this and max out your spins. <laughs> you must spin to win for the new Christian. Oh my God. Well, I mean, it would have been Jewish. I think that'd be Jewish. Hey, look. A cutscene. A flower <laughs> snake. Forgot her name. Clearly a flower dragon. I think it's oh. I think it's supposed to be a lord or something. I don't know, they're all named after uh Christian beings. Are you sure? Okay. Because that looks like Nidhogg. Nidhogg is Nordic. Yes. That's my point. He's supposed to be faster, clearly. You know, I mean Nidhogg like does like feed off of the root of y of the tree of Yggdrasil, so. But this one is like, actually a Perfect. plant. First try. I took no damage. If you had fallen, would you have to go all the way back to a platform? <laughs> you should. You should bonsai. Go back and do it the right way. <laughs> Now this thing is clearly inspired by Hindu religion or culture. Looks like a Naga. And also, what do you mean Christian demons? There aren't a lot of demons actually named in Christianity. I mean, there's a few. It's usually just a bunch of names for. Well, not really. I mean. Like the more. Well, I'm like, trying to think of a couple. There's, there's a few, but it's not like named biblically. It's named in like all their works. Yeah. It's like they're like. Yeah. I, mean, no, I think it's a mixture of religions that they like to see. Oh well, every all of them basically. Uh, I mean, demons are older than Christianity. For which one did Faust come from? No way, that's a story. 
Okay, well, that's not even a major demon, that's just side demon. I mean, there's demons in Egyptian religion, Babylonian religion. Things older than dumb, too. Oh boy, you're going to learn. Well, you're about to learn her or something. Wait. Plant Dragon turned into a lady? That. Why would you have, like, willingly. I mean, if she never does that, does that mean she's basically invulnerable? I don't know. I mean, did she release any seeds? Yes. She got one mom on the ground. Oh. The well, then it's not really important. She just gave birth. Which is still gross. Dead. Which is still gross. Oh my. You know what that just reminded me of? Uh, Goma from Ocarina of Time. That's the first boss. Okay, why does Beowulf only have the. You know, that E-rated game where the first boss has children in front of you? You know, for kids! Yeah, now that you mention it... And you know... I mean, it's a plant. I mean, everything plants do is less disgusting. Right? Because, I mean, it's less like us. And the less like us it is, the less disgusting it is. Because what we really think is... Because what we really think is that we're disgusting with ourselves. No, I mean she's not. I said she's not doing anything. Oh, she's like, she's like just waving around her arms, and she's getting wailed on. Super mode, which only lasts for like what five seconds. Ah. You know, if demons could manifest, do you think they would be killable, killable with just bullets? Well, if we're to take a lesson from Doom, guy. I was thinking just that. But isn't in Doom like they're more like an alien species? No, no, Mars. People that don't think of Mars, uh, they're totally from hell. That would be Mars. Oh. But still. They have like entire civilization and you know armies, yeah. Which I like the idea of because I mean, why wouldn't they? I mean, I've heard the theory like demons and angels are just just aliens. Realized. Nope, don't captain up, captain's quarters. I, I, congratulations, you solved the biggest mystery. I did. I mean, Cat-tober. I mean, now that that solves, like, the world can just end and restart. Yeah! We, this is the pinnacle. No, I'm, I'm ready for Thanos to snap his fingers. You know... I don't feel so well. Thanos... <laughs> Thanos could have just doubled the resources in the universe instead. But... I mean... Wait a second! <laughs> For movie Thanos, that puts a big hole in his plans. Yeah. For comic book Thanos, he, that wouldn't fly by him. I mean... There's a lot of things he could have done. He could have had it so people he could have, have a lower birth rate. He could have created a whole second universe to move half the people over to. Well, that would have been pretty shitty too. Because it might as well be dead. Not really. At least the people aren't like dead dead. Yeah. yeah, but I mean, you're not going to see them again. I would say that the best thing is, honestly, if it's overpopulation is the problem, just have people like have like half the birth rate. 
Within, within two generations, everything's solved. Okay, so this one's called Burial. Echidna. Knuckles? What the? Okay, so mm, I guess. Yeah, it is spelled the same way. Mephisto. Okay, so those things are called Mephisto. Blitz, Blitz. which is learned for lightning. Frost. Glory. Yeah, no! Mine. No, that's not. Anyway, that'll be it for now. See you on Captober.